Okay, when it comes to manifestation, how you feel about yourself is the most important thing. Now, what I mean by feeling, I do not mean emotion. I mean a deep belief. And what I've found is extremely helpful when applying the law of assumption or when I'm trying to manifest in my life is I have, this, I have found that if you change the word belief to feel, it's a game changer. And the reason I say this is because the way we navigate this 3D reality is through our feeling, right? And feeling, I'm talking about our senses, touch, taste, smell, sound, vision, all of these things. These are the things we use to justify whether something is real in our external world. And we do the same thing when we fall asleep at night and we experience a dream. Because if I was to ask you in the middle of a dream at night, if you were asleep, if you were to be like, is this real? You would say yes. It is only until you wake up from that dream that you think, oh, it was just a dream. Now, the way you experience that dream is, again, you're using your senses, but you're using the senses of the man within, which is the man of the spirit. Okay, right? And this man exists or is your imagination. So when it comes to changing the way you feel about yourself to manifest your desires, what you want to do is immerse yourself when it comes to your imagination is by immersing all of your five senses, right? And understanding that if you can imagine using your five senses, it gives all the tones of reality to your desire. And then you are convincing your subconscious mind that what you are experiencing is real. And once you manage to convince your subconscious mind and you believe it, that's how you manifest. That's how you make real, right? Because as a man thinketh in his heart or as a man thinketh in his subconscious mind, so is he. So if you can communicate to your subconscious mind through the language it understands, which is the language of feeling, right? The feeling of something to be real, that is how you can accelerate your manifestations, so if you want to change the way you, 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 you see yourself or feel about yourself, put yourself in scenarios in your mind's eye using your five senses that would imply that you are starting to see and live differently. If you want to be more respected, if you want to have people speak fondly of you, go into your mind's eye, go into imagination, close your, close your physical eyes and go into the, the eye of the spirit and imagine people saying wonderful things about you, you actively hearing, you have to do this in a way where you're not trying to make something happen, but rather you are bathing yourself in the experience that is happening now, right? People think, well, I can't do this as hard, right? You should be doing this in a way when as you're doing it, it feels like you don't want to stop doing it because it feels good because you are presently experiencing it. That's how you know you're doing it correctly. Now, for some of you that may have a hard time to get to that stage because you have a lot of resistance or you're currently stuck in an emotion right now that is unpleasant, calm your nervous system first. You know, breathe. Calm your nervous system by exhaling, making your exhales longer than your inhales, right? Release some of that energy by going for a run, exercise, right? Do something to relax yourself first and then go into your imagination so you have a clean slate to start with when you imagine something new, all right? And then start to imagine yourself experiencing all these wonderful things in the present moment, all right? Now, you don't have to imagine all of these crazy things in great detail. Pick, pick, something, pick something simple for you to imagine that would imply the fulfillment of whatever it is you're trying to manifest, right? If you want people to, if you want people to speak fondly of you, if you want to be seen in a certain way, imagine yourself having a conversation with someone you know that is essentially validating that about you, all right? And pick that with any desire you please. All right, it's been your boy. If you found this video helpful, make sure you like, comment, share, um, and also check out the audio books in my bio. I'm sure they'll help you out as well. All right.